I'm coined the painter of memories. What I try to do is make people smile with my art. My father ended up being a ceramics teacher in his retirement. My mother was a fashion designer and art teacher. They were a big influence. For twice, my father would bring home a tablet of paper and a pencil, and I'd sit for hours and lose myself in the day, drawing, mostly automobiles. It's fun to come down to the studio. You're just involved between the paint and the paint, and the painting and the paint. Some of my best friends are of restaurants like Chuck Wagon, places like Good Memories. I listen to people and I hear their memories. I hear the women to dry goods, people with their mother going down for back to school to get their clothes, or one of the many theaters in town. I enjoy the research. But more than anything, once I have the research done, I'm drawing. Once you're looking at a blank page and you have a concept in your mind, Putting it on paper, you just lose yourself. In honor of my mom begged me to paint all those years. I put a cross, a white cross in painting, hide it and ripped it in painting in her honor. People actually come up at shows or there are children. They come up and just start looking until they find it and they say, there is mommy. I almost have an endless supply in this little 12 mile wide state of cool stuff to paint. I really thrive off of the feeling of other people. It's hard to describe, but when you see people smile, it may not be your memory, but it actually has become memory, and share it is really sort of cool.